For anyone wondering as well, we do have our little masks on us. Always with us. in a new state, we're in Massachusetts, we're across the line to Connecticut and New Massachusetts. Yeah. Yeah. Tomorrow, never see the end of the night through sorrow. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done, what do we do to love? What do we do to love? Oh mate, John what do we do to love? When everything's said and done, what do we do to love? So we're on our trip to um, Arcadia, which is very exciting. We, ha we started off in New York this morning at about 8.30 and drove all the way to Harvard. Which is beautiful. Um, which is stunning. It's amazing. Stunning so it's very hot. So in America, I reckon it's like maybe 95 degrees. And for us, it's like 28. No, it was like 30. Okay, so it's pretty hot. It's pretty warm. It's very muggy. And now we're in Boston. Harvard University is in Boston, but it's kind of on the outskirts, which on is the outskirts. called Cambridge. Apparently we're going to try some lobster rolls. Yeah. We're in Boston, Massachusetts, and then we're going to Maine. Oh, we're going to Maine, which is Arcadia. We're, we're learning US stuff. geography very yeah. well. So we've crossed over uh, through three? Yeah, I talked about it before. We went through Connecticut yeah. and Massachusetts, mm -hmm. and then we're going into Maine tomorrow. Yeah. Every time we cross the line, we have a party song in the car. So it's party in the Because we're with Adrian Jackson, our pandemic BFFs. A pandemic. <laughs> I can't even speak. No, you can't. Pandemic BFFs. Do you like Olivia? <laughs> Check in to a hotel in Boston, which is cool. They allow dogs, and then we're going to be here for a night. And so we're gonna check out Boston today, tomorrow, and then we're driving to Maine. Woohoo! little town mm -hmm. and it's kind of like those back in Christchurch just like grow up a seaside town yeah. but it's probably a little bit more established mm. and it might be a bit older as well I'd say yeah and you see the American flag because 4th <laughs> of July and she's been in the pack and everyone's been commenting on her but she has done so well today she ran up the mountains it's like back in New Zealand and we let her off the lead for the first time in like 10 months she had the best time yeah. and now she's booked yeah. Um, and then we went to this bakery, a blueberry pie, and blueberries are grown here, so it's like a big thing here. So it's kind of like lobster and blueberries. Behind me, they're doing bubbles. I don't know if you can see. Giant Very bubbles. cute. But we're sitting in front of the harbour and um, kind of waiting if there's fireworks. We don't think there are because fireworks have been banned in a lot of places for yeah. 
4th of July, but there does seem to be a lot of people here. So Adrian and Jackson have gone to scout out and talk to a shop owner. Yeah. Uh, so hopefully we can do that. But it was a bit of a shame because today there was no like views on the mountains that we went up. Um, it's a bit foggy. The, it was the cloud very was foggy. Quite low. And we were going to look at the sunset um, up on the big mountain that we went to yeah. yesterday. But it's like, it's nothing really. Yeah. We've got a few bit of footage from the, the daytime, which was still very beautiful. It was really pretty. But um, today we just didn't make sense. I feel like we just have to come back. For anyone wondering as well, we do have our little masks on us. Always with us. And this place has been really good. There's been a lot of yeah. people with masks. Boston, there wasn't a lot of people with masks and it was not yeah. as like comforting, but here like almost everyone has it or they have it around their neck and then they're like, we'll put it up as soon as they get like anywhere near like six yeah. feet. Yeah, and then when we went away on holiday a few weeks ago, we also um, were in, the, in a nature place and mm. not many people were in masks there either. So yeah. it's really refreshing to see a community that are really trying to We did to have warnings though, like we were supposed to um, either quarantine for 14 days mm -hmm. or get a COVID test because yeah. we were coming from New York and we had got the COVID test done last week yeah. and then we were literally waiting for it and then on Thursday, we still the day before the we were coming here, the Airbnb owner was like, hi, like, do you have your results yet? I'm like, no. And then, luckily, I found on the website that as at 1st of July, um, people from New York could come in because we've like not really a hot spot anymore. Yeah. So we're like, yes. So, so yeah. still don't know if we're negative or not. Did you? No, check? no, we did. We, you we got yeah, we got the results. That said we were no fine. COVID, but, and um, we're negative on the antibodies too. Yeah. But so it means that we possibly haven't had it, which is really great. I also cut my finger today. This Very morning good. it was a really, really sharp good. knife when I was trying oh. to cut some potatoes, but you know. So now we're gonna see if this fireworks. And I hope there is, which would be pretty cool. And then we're gonna go have our Fourth of July dinner. Yeah, it's with be the a team. Late dinner, but it's gonna be so nice. Yeah, and then tomorrow, I think we might come back here and maybe try and do one more walk, and then we're gonna yeah. leave because it's, it's like an eight-hour drive. So it's a bit of a, a bit of a hike home. Mm. So yeah.